Chief Meteorologist Mike Nelson is joining us now with your first alert forecast. And Mike, things are changing. Oh, they are. And folks are going to be very thankful for a lot of snow up in the mountains this weekend. <laughs> if you have yes. some skiing or snowboarding plans. Down here, we're not going to see that much moisture, but a lot of wind coming our way. It'll be very windy by morning, about 35 degrees. Windy through 9 a.m. and noon. The temperature's a little bit cooler than today as a front moves through. Now, down here... We had a really pretty sunset tonight. This system coming in is going to leave most of its moisture up in the mountains, and we'll get mostly mid and high level clouds, gusty winds. But by Saturday night into early Sunday, there will be some snow heading for the Mile High City. 61 today on this Thanksgiving, 36 this morning. The normals are 49 and 22 right now under a partly cloudy sky with a big bright moon. Temperatures in the mid 40s, pressure falling. Winds are out of the west southwest at 11. Here's the map. There's a cold front coming into Colorado right now. The mild and dry weather moves away. Windy and cold over the northeast on this Thanksgiving day. And a series of storms will be lining up and heading toward the state over the next few days. When that happens, we tend to get the strong winds on the plains, but the moisture mostly stays in the mountains, up to half a foot of snow expected overnight tonight with low temperatures there, teens and 20s on the plains, mostly holding in the 30s tonight. And by morning, we'll see those low temperatures drop down to around 35 in Denver, 39 at Broomfield, but expect strong winds by about 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning. Tomorrow morning, we'll have some high clouds early, and then we're going to see the snow on the increase in the afternoon across much of the state. Gusty winds expected to continue across Colorado. A little bit cooler than today with just low to mid 50s on the plains. And in the mountains, those temperatures are going to be mostly climbing up into the low to mid 30s. A lot of snow up there, strong winds. Bundle up, but enjoy the powder for tomorrow. Tonight's forecast, becoming windy late, a low temperature of 32, winds shifting to the northwest at 10 to 20 miles per hour. A very windy day tomorrow. Snow in the mountains, but just windy on the plains. 20 to 40 miles per hour with some higher gusts at times. 53 will be our high temperature. We have the strong winds coming in for tomorrow. Then, looking ahead, we'll start to see snow increasing again Saturday morning as yet the next system begins to come in. And that's going to drop 8 to 16 inches of snow over the central and northern mountains by Saturday night into early Sunday morning. We get some light snow here but at about midnight until about 6 a.m. on Sunday, maybe an inch or two. And then in time for the Bronco game, clear skies and just kind of cold. Here's your seven day. Tomorrow it's windy and 53. Snow showers develop later on Saturday into early Sunday. Sunday the sky is clear, but a cool high of 40. Next week there'll be more snow heading to the mountains, but on the plains just some clouds. 45 Monday, upper 40s to low 50s Tuesday through Thursday. All right, thanks, Mike. Allison is up next with what the Broncos are thankful for.